fashion. Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Layla Wood and if you are new to this channel, Welcome, and if you've already been here before, thank you so much for returning. So today, as you know by the title, we are doing a fall makeup look, something I actually haven't done on my channel yet, um, is like doing a makeup look. And it's something I've actually really wanted to do for a long time. I tried a while back, um, I did uh, put it in one of my videos, I'll link it down below, it's called Where I've Been, and you will see me doing my friend's makeup, and it is a complete fail, um, but I want to finally do an actual legit makeup look. Um, so I decided, since it's the season of fall, October, I want to do a really nice fall makeup look. Um, so basically for the past uh, week and a half, I was trying to film the 10 step K beauty routine for one week and seeing if there was any changes from start to finish with my skin. Well, there was quite a bit of change and I'm not gonna lie, I was really, really ticked. But at the same time, I kind of understand. So basically what happened is when I started it off, I kind of, the first day, first, second day, I kind of really enjoyed it. It was really nice. It made my skin feel a lot more alive and um, not as dull. But going through the next few days, I only made it to day four um, out of seven and I started to absolutely hate it. And it is because I found that it was breaking my skin out completely and it wasn't letting my skin have time to heal in between those processes and stuff. I just kept every single day, kept putting more stuff on and more products. And that's 10 products. Like, I don't know, I find that a lot. So in the end, I did decide to stop um, because I just felt it was probably best for my skin to just halt on the entire process. But the one thing I did actually really like is that this 10 step K beauty routine made my skin feel very prepped and ready for putting makeup on, like a good amount of makeup, a nice glam look. So I, that's what I am here to do today uh, because I did it so much, my face does still feel quite ready to put makeup on. Let's get right into it. So as you guys can see, I have already started with a base and that is because I just find it takes me a really long time to just get a base on, make sure that none of my makeup is shifting in certain spots. I have to like, I don't know, it's like a whole process for me. And if you guys are ever interested, like please let me know. Um, I will definitely do a video on my entire process on how I do a base first. I'm not like a professional or anything, but I think I do a pretty decent job. Anyways, okay, so let's get right into it. I still did a base moisturizer, I put my my concealer on, a little bit of foundation, and I set my face. Um, and I do want to talk about one thing about when I set my face, something I saw in a Jeffree Star video um, about, he does a makeup tutorial from like a like hundred years ago or something like that, or like a, from like, you know, doing like a tutorial that his like grandmother would have done like years ago or something. Basically, there was a technique in that video where when setting the face, he used a cotton pad exactly like this. And and I was like, hmm, okay. And he seemed to really like it. He was kind of surprised. And I was like, okay, queen, I gotta try this. So when I did, I literally have not been able to find anything better to set my face with. A beauty blender doesn't do it. Uh, brushes, mm-mm, honey. Freaking cotton pad, I don't know. Amazing, amazing. So basically what I wanna be doing is a colorful fall, fun kind of look. I wanna be using yellows. I wanna be using oranges and burgundies, some browns. I'm kind of inspired by a very burnt kind of uh, sunflower look, you know, or a uh, fall time sunset vibe. I don't know. I So I am today going to be using the James Charles palette um, because, well, it has a lot of freaking amazing colors and I genuinely really do enjoy the formula. So first things first, I do want to start off by taping my eyes because um, I want a really nice, like, sharp look. Um, so what I do is I just go in with some washi tape and I do just kind of 
lay it on my hand a few times just so it's not super sticky and takes makeup off, but like sticky enough so we're, where it will stay and not, you know, you know what I mean? I'm sure you guys know what I mean, you know? And I'm just gonna do that too. The other side. Well, because I want fun, colorful, I'm just gonna dip in with this bright orange in the top here and just go in to my crease, because why not? Do I know how this look is gonna turn out in the end? No, I do not. Um, but we're just gonna kind of go with it. Guys, and isn't it like insane how fast October has already gone by? Like, what day is it? Oh my God, it's Thanksgiving today and like Canadian. I'm Canadian, hello. Um, and yes, it is Thanksgiving today. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. I'm actually supposed to be in Quebec right now. Um, as uh, you guys can see, I'm in my house, in my apartment, um, in Ontario, not in Quebec. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just kind of being messy with this because I know that uh, there's gonna be other shit being put on, I don't know. It's not done. Um, I'm gonna dip into this yellow here and hit this, hit this, hit this real good so it looks like a nice sunset. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Guys, I still don't even know what we're gonna be doing for Halloween yet. Like, I still haven't figured out our family costume. So, uh, we're getting a little close on that. <laughs> we have a few different ideas. We saw some cute things in store. Yeah, not sure yet. Usually I already have that all planned out, but we're getting a little close. I look like a sunset. Next, I want to kind of go in with some brown. in with that bright orange and just kind of brighten that orange back up in the inner crease again. Pop that orange color back in there to brighten that up. Mm. Oh, I just dropped a brush. All right, and I'm just gonna go back in with the yellow just to pop it in a little bit again at the top. Next, we are gonna go in with a, like, I don't know what you would call this, like a small shader, but I wanna use one of these like super shimmery ones. Maybe cut the crease a little bit first. I've never really done that before. Am I admitting something? <gasps> Exposed. Let's do that. Let's just try it out. Oh fuck. Let's give this a go. this in the inner and then this on the outer closer into the browns and that's what I'm doing just so you so so y'all know Just gonna go back in with these dark colors and just blend them out a little bit. Ah. 
And then lastly, just gonna go back in with the bright orange before I take my tape off here, just on the ends and everything. Okay, so this is what I got so far and I'm. this is now where I... So now we have a nice, very sharp look because I want to do a nice sharp black wing. Next is liner. And I think I'm gonna be going in with, yeah, this one. I can't tell. I don't know what brand it is. It's completely wiped off, but it's, um, it's a gooder. Let me concentrate, all right? Give me a hot minute. Oh. Okay, we're almost freaking done. We're basically done the eye look. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I don't usually do my brows. I just, cause they're just a lot. But I'll do them for you. Hello? What is this? Tray stick? Girl, you should, oh no, 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 no. It'll have to do, but like, Come on, come on. Clearly I never do my eyebrows because I don't know what in the hell I am doing. But that's all right. Do I own a spoolie? I used to, but then it got really dusty and gross, so I threw it the fuck out. Yep, that's about it. Cool, because I'm gonna do lashes very, very last. So I think I'm just gonna go in with contour and uh, contour, highlight, and some blush, then my lashes, then I'll do lipstick. That's what it will be, and that will be the end. Um, okay, so. some nose contour. Did I just look, make like myself look crazy? <laughs> no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Love this. Okay, hold on. Let's just blend it out a lot. We're just gonna have to go with it at this point, honestly. I don't know what else to fucking do. And now I'm gonna go in with some highlighter. So there's highlight. Okay, and now I'm just gonna pop on some blush. Can I find my blush brush? Don't know where that went. That's all right, and that's okay. We'll just use this. I just like to take this and kind of blend the contour blush and highlight together to make it all look kind of like one. Now we are going to do some lashes. Um, I do like to start with a little bit of mascara just to kind of hold them up, but not too much or it gets like just, I don't know. It's, it just gets gross. Let that dry a little bit and while that's doing its thing, I'm gonna start with gluing the first lash. Bam. I put these on backwards. I think I put my lashes on backwards, guys. Like this one is supposed to be on this side right now. Mm -hmm. We're just gonna go with it, you know? Hey, it's just a different look. There's no right or wrong way of doing things. Right? All right, okay, cool, 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 cool. I think I got those on. What do you guys think? <laughs> Let me know down in the comments below. It's noticeable that I put my lashes on backwards. <laughs> So 
So I'm not gonna lie, I definitely wanna add in some color into like the bottom here. And I think I wanna do like a little bit of like the orange and then into the yellow. My forever fall favorite lipstick is going to be this Mary Kay color, um, Ruby Night. Yes, okay, yeah, Ruby Night by Mary Kay. Love this color. <laughs> okay, well, um, <clears throat> this uh, completes this part of this makeup look. Right now, I think I'm gonna go do my hair a little bit, get dressed, pack up, go do a little photo shoot, and I think that's gonna be the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys could have maybe learned a little bit off of this and got some cool tips from it. And that's basically it. I just wanted to do a makeup look finally and bring one to my channel. And honestly, the fall time is my favorite for makeup looks because these are my favorite colors to use. I don't know if you guys need a close up or something, but. <laughs> But anyways, this is the end look. So we're gonna go do a little photo shoot and you'll see some of the photos for that. And then, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just see you guys later. <laughs>